Welcome to our guide on adding dual pass keys. In this video, we'll explain what pass keys are and how you can set them up on your devices. Pass keys are a new type of digital credentials that are more secure and make multi-factor authentication faster and easier. Built on the FIDO2 web authentication standard, they use public key cryptography to better secure your accounts and use biometrics to make multi-factor authentication more convenient. Passkey can be created on a smartphone, tablet, laptop, or desktop and be copied and synced across multiple devices on the same platform. Passkey can also be stored in a password vault like 1Password or on a FIDO2 certified token like YubiKey5. We will provide instructions for setting up dual pass keys on Apple devices, Windows Hello, Android devices, phone or tablet, and 1Password and YubiKey. If you would like to skip ahead to the device that you are adding a pass key to, please utilize the provided timestamps. Now, let's go through the steps to add a pass key to your device. We'll show you how to set up your Duo Pass key on your Apple devices. Ensure that you have a Mac computer running Mac OS 13 or later in Safari, or an iPhone running iOS 16 or later, or an iPad running iPad OS 16 or later, an iCloud Keychain Sync enabled on all Apple devices that you will use with Duo. All devices must share the same iCloud account to be able to use your pass key across Apple devices. Set up Touch ID Face ID on your Apple device by going to Settings and scrolling down to select Touch ID and Password or Face ID and Passcode. Log in to a Georgia Tech SSO website such as campus.gotech.edu and enter your credentials. On the Duo prompt, you will see the authentication method you used recently in an Other Options link. Select Other Options. Select Manage Devices, which is the last selection. You will then be prompted to verify your identity. Select one of the options you have already set up for your Duo account. You will be taken to a new window Select Add a Device. After selecting it, a pop-up will appear with options. Select Touch ID and then Continue. You might get some pop-ups from your browser. Follow the prompted steps. The next time you log into a Georgia Tech SSO website such as canvas.gotech.edu from an Apple device with the same iCloud account, you can choose Touch ID or Face ID on your Duo prompt to verify your identity. We'll show you how to set up your Duo Pass key with Windows Hello. Ensure that you have a device running Windows 10 or later and Windows Hello enabled to sign in with a PIN, fingerprint, or facial recognition and a supported browser. Note. Windows Hello is not supported in Chrome Incognito or Edge in private browsing sessions. In the search bar on your laptop or desktop, search for Windows Hello. Select Setup Pin Sign In. This will open a pop-up of the settings. You will be prompted with different ways to sign in. Complete the setup for the option you want to use. You can complete as many of these as you would like. Log in to a Georgia Tech SSO website such as campus.gotech.edu and enter your credentials. On the Duo prompt, you will see the authentication method you used recently in an Other Options link. Select Other Options. Select Manage Devices, which is the last selection. You will then be prompted to verify your identity. Select one of the options you have already set up for your Duo account. You will be taken to a new window. Select Add a Device. There will be a pop-up. 
select Windows Hello and then continue. You might get some pop-ups from your browser. Follow the prompted steps and you will get a confirmation. Added Windows Hello. The next time you log into a Georgia Tech SSO website such as canvas.gotech.edu, you can choose Windows Hello on your Duo prompt to verify your identity. We'll show you how to set up your Duo Pass key on your Android devices. Ensure that you have an Android device that supports biometrics and has facial or fingerprint unlock set up on it. Log in to a Georgia Tech SSO website such as canvas.gotech.edu and enter your credentials. On the Duo prompt, you will see the authentication method you used recently and an Other Options link. Select Other Options. Select Manage Devices, which is the last selection. You will then be prompted to verify your identity. Select one of the options you have already set up for your Duo account. You will be taken to a new window select Add a Device. There will be a pop-up with options. Select Device Verification and then Continue. Verify your identity. Use your fingerprint or Face ID or enter your PIN. After completing those steps, you will see a confirmation. Added this device. You will then see Android Biometric added to your devices. The next time you log into a Georgia Tech SSO website, such as canvas.gotech.edu, from this Android device, you can choose fingerprint or face ID on your dual prompt to verify your identity. We'll show you how to set up your dual pass key using your phone or tablet. Ensure that you have Windows 10 or later and iOS 16 or iPad OS 16 or later, or Android 10 or later. Log in to a Georgia Tech SSO website such as canvas.gotech.edu and enter your credentials. On the Duo prompt, you will see the authentication method you used recently and an Other Options link. Select Other Options. Select Manage Devices, which is the last selection. You will then be prompted to verify your identity. Select one of the options you have already set up for your Duo account. You will be taken to a new window. Select Add a Device. Select Security Key and then Continue. You will get a pop-up with a QR code. Scan the QR code with your phone camera and follow the prompts on your phone. Note, if you see different options, you may need to hit cancel and then select use a phone or tablet. After completing the previously mentioned steps, you should see the security key added to your devices. The next time you log in to a Georgia Tech SSO website, such as canvas.gotech.edu, you can choose Security Key on your Duo prompt to verify your identity. If you see a pop-up, select iPhone, iPad, or Android device and click Next. It will pull up a QR code. Scan the QR code with your phone camera and authenticate with your Touch ID, Fingerprint, Face ID on your phone and you will be logged in. We'll show you how to store your Duo Passkey in 1Password Password Manager. Ensure that you have a 1Password account and 1Password browser extension installed. Make sure your 1Password is unlocked in your browser. Log in to a Georgia Tech SSO website such as canvas.gotech.edu and enter your credentials. On the Duo prompt, you will see the authentication method you used recently and an Other Options link. Select Other Options. Select Manage Devices, which is the last selection. You will then be prompted to verify your identity. Select one of the options you have already set up for your Duo account. 
You will be taken to a new window. Select Add a Device. Select Security Key and then Continue. One password should give you a prompt to save Pass Key as a new item. Click Save. You should now see the One Password Pass Key added to your devices. The next time you log into a Georgia Tech SSO website such as canvas.gotech.edu, you can use your One Password Pass Key to verify your identity. Select Security Key on your dual prompt. You should see a 1Password prompt if you have your 1Password unlocked. Click Sign In and you will be logged in successfully. We'll show you how to store your Duo Pass Key on your YubiKey. Ensure that you have a YubiKey 5 plugged in and the YubiCo Authenticator app installed on your laptop or desktop. Open the YubiCo Authenticator app and click Pass Keys. It will prompt you to create a PIN for your security key. Go ahead and set up a PIN. Log in to a Georgia Tech SSO website such as canvas.gotech.edu and enter your credentials. On the Duo prompt, you will see the authentication method you used recently in an Other Options link. Select Other Options. Select Manage Devices, which is the last selection. You will then be prompted to verify your identity. Select one of the options you have already set up for your Duo account. You will then be taken to a new window. Select Add a Device. Select Security Key and then Continue. Follow the prompt to enter your Security Key PIN and touch your YubiKey. The pass key will be saved to your YubiKey. You should now see the security key added to your devices. The next time you log into a Georgia Tech SSO website such as canvas.gotech.edu, you can choose security key when your dual prompt to verify your identity. You will be prompted to enter your security key pin and touch your YubiKey to authenticate. You will then be logged in successfully. Thank you for watching the How to Add a Duo Pass Key tutorial video. If you encounter any issues or need assistance, please contact the Administrative Services Center via email at support at oit.gotech.edu or by phone at 404-385-1111.